Okay, so we are finally back in the guest house after a really long day. So it's now 11.45 p.m. Uh, we reached back really pretty late, like we came at about 11, uh, 11 plus. And then um, I realised that I didn't even sleep the entire day because I was just so tired. So we set off really early just now. Um, not really early, about 8 a.m., 8 plus a.m. And we went to Bukansan to trek. So, and we were talking between two treks because one of it was, uh, so supposedly would take us to the peak of Bukansan, but it took five hours. So the fire was up and down, as in up and down is five hours. But we weren't dressed properly. We didn't have like proper like trekking shoes. All I had was like my vans, uh, and I think none of us had, yeah, none of us had proper shoes basically. So then we started for like one that was shorter, supposedly shorter, and only took three hours to go up and down. But turns out we also spent 5 hours on it because I have no idea why we spent 5 hours. I think maybe because we were like physically not that fit or whatever. So I think we started about 10 and we came down at about 3 and then we bought kimbap when we arrived at the station. Uh, I think it was the Kirim station that we got off at and then we bought kimbap at the station itself and then at about 1pm we ate it for some lunch because we were so tired and we didn't even have enough water. So that's how unprepared we were. And then after that, we continued tracking down and then we found a, a restaurant because there are a lot of restaurants once you reach like the base of the, the mountain. And then we had a late lunch there. We had a very good lunch. And then after that, we took a taxi back to Myeongdong where we washed up or we just bathed. And then we went back out into Myeongdong to shop. So we did like a lot of last minute shopping and um, yeah, makeup and clothes whatever so and then we had a great great dinner it's our last dinner in Korea and so fast it's really like the last day official like last full day in Korea so that was a really good it was a traditional supposedly a traditional Korean dinner there was like beef and pork that was really good and then we went to this eight floor Daiso that just opened up so we were supposed to go there like two nights ago but we kept uh, postponing the plan and we finally went today uh, got a few stuff like kind of like useless stuff and like stuff like presents for my friends also so yeah that's it and then uh, now we're back we just finished packing our bags still in the middle of packing our bags a lot of things to pack and I have to edit yesterday's vlog and I will probably combine today and tomorrow's vlog because tomorrow is just half day I don't think we have much going on I'll see how it goes and yep yeah, so that's it for today and I'll see you guys tomorrow So this is our last day in Korea and we are now at the airport already. It's now about 1, no, it's like 3.43 p.m. We, I think the boarding is just about to start but we still have some time. So yeah, we woke up this morning uh, quite late, about 9, 9 plus and then we were supposed to go to this place called Isaac Toast or like Isaac Toast uh, for brunch. But then it turns out it goes on Sundays so and then we went to this uh, could like go to kind of like a Korean Chinese restaurant to have a, uh, our brunch instead and yeah then we went back to the hotel um, back to the guest house to get our luggage and then uh, we headed to the airport we took the airport limousine it's like this bus that stops at several stops and then it stops at uh, this hotel that's really near our guest house so we took that it was 14,000 won if you use your tea money so yeah we got on that and then we were at the airport, we checked in, we were a bit hungry again, so we went to find some food and found Taco Bell. So we tried it, it was good, I liked it, and I really hope that they'll come back to Singapore, because apparently they came to Singapore a couple of years back, but I think it didn't work out, so it closed down. But if it comes back, I will go and eat it, because it's nice. So yeah, today was really nothing much going on at all. Yeah, at all, so. So yeah, and then now we'll just wait for a plane and then head back to Singapore. This was a really, it was actually quite a long trip, it's 9 days, but it felt really short honestly. As all trips, like you know, whenever you're on holiday, it always feels short. So yep, heading back to Singapore and I'll see you guys later.